Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, we are going to be talking about something pretty interesting uh, and it's related to the world of email marketing. And for this specific one, we're going to be discussing how to use Brevo, uh, which is a powerful email marketing tool, and we're going to go through them step by step. So let's go ahead and get started. And of course, first things first is we're going to visit Brevo, uh, which is here, uh, brevo.com. And once you are here on the website, uh, you can click the get started button, which is right up here, or just sign up for free. Um, that's basically the same button and uh, you'll be able to go through and uh, create your account if you don't have one yet but if you have one you can just click the uh, login button right here after that you're just going to be filling out the boxes over here or if you want to use your Google account or your Apple account then you can use that to sign up uh, so let's go ahead and do that first and then we'll get back to you and then once you are signed in, you'll be able to uh, see this. Uh, let's start with the basics part uh, of the uh, profile setup here. And you just put in your name, your company name, uh, or website if you have that. And then we'll just click next. And after that, we'll just be in uh, inputting the address as well as the country. So we're going to go through and set that up. And then once you are uh, once you've inputted the address, you'll be uh, sent here, which is going to be talking a little bit about, about your business. So it's going to ask how many people are in your team. We're just going to see uh, this for now. And then for this one, uh, how many contacts we have. Uh, let's just say no contacts yet. And then we don't want to sell online for this specific tutorial. So we're just going to say that. And then uh, if you don't want to receive any product updates or marketing tips and etc., you can just click this. Or if you want to, then you can just leave that unclicked but for this one we're just going to do that and then after that you will end up here uh, and uh, you will uh, input your number and uh, get to proceed to the next step and then once you have inputted your uh, number you'll end up here which will show all the uh, plans for using brevo so here we have the free the starter business as well as Bravo Plus, which has all the different uh, uh, features that uh, uh, Bravo has to offer. And we're just gonna click the uh, free one for now, since we're just gonna go through the tutorial here. And here you can uh, add your, you can check out your, de your contacts, uh, which will be uh, kind of the core of the use for this app. Uh, so you're going to be uh, adding more contacts to this. You can also import contacts uh, that you already have available. And then here we can check the lists as well. Uh, if you have more um, contacts, you can make your own list here. So you can basically uh, go through this and uh, add multiple contacts into one list. So that way you can send everything in one go to... Uh, uh, everybody that's in the list itself. Uh, so here we have, we only have one contact, which is our own, um, but we can add more to that, more uh, people into it. And then we can add their email, last name, first name, and number, and then they'll be added to the list. And of course, uh, we can also check here, uh, check at the segments. And uh, currently we don't have any. So these are the save filters uh, that are creative in the previous versions of the contact page. Uh, so you can have them set here. Here we do have access to the form. So here we can customize our subscription forms so that we can uh, pretty much go to the audience and capture details to connect on a personal level. So basically this has a more detailed approach to how you want to uh, get in contact with uh, your audience. Uh, so, and then here we have the settings page so you can manage the attributes of your contract contacts and transactions. So let's go ahead and open that. So here we can add a bunch of new stuff. So we can um, add in a new attribute. Uh, we have uh, also transactional attributes as well as calculated values. So this is kind of the automation part of this, uh, of Brevo itself. Uh, but you, you'll first need to input all of this information beforehand so that once you have everything uh, set, everything can be automated and uh, get sorted out uh, and you won't have to do it all over again. 
And then here we have the campaign uh, dashboard. So here we have just one contact, this is ourselves. Uh, here are the opens. So basically uh, how many people have opened your email, you can check that and then clicks as well as block lists. Uh, we can create another campaign if we want to as well. So if you want to do more multiple uh, campaigns, you can do that. Uh, and then here are the email campaigns that we have sorted. Uh, as well as uh, the SMS uh, and uh, WhatsApp web push as well is available here. Uh, so you can um, kind of send notifications to your customers on uh, desktop or mobile. And uh, we also have Facebook ads for those who uh, are paying the more premium versions of Bravo. But here we can also check your templates. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, so here we can add the template name, a subject line, preview text, as well as uh, who the email is from, and then uh, the name is, uh, who is who it is from. Uh, and then, so that way you can, everything that will be uh, set here, uh, everything can be viewed. Let's go back here to contacts. So if you uh, go to the list and uh, you send out an email to all the uh, people in the list itself. It'll all uh, be um, based off of what you have written on your uh, template here. So, yeah. So everything that will be sent to the list is basically everything that you put in here. And then for the statistics, uh, we can see here, we can view the statistics that uh, are uh, related to our campaign. Uh, we can see uh, all of the emails, uh, SMS as well. So you can see, you can basically follow all of the uh, trends of, uh, or the uh, kind of interactions that you've had with your audience. And uh, you can see the total sent recipients, open, click, unsubscribed, replied. So you can make sure that everything has been uh, checked as well as total soft hard bounces. So, uh, and then for settings, you can also change your configuration for your default settings as well as test your list. Uh, and uh, you have unsubscribe pages. You also have Google Analytics to help you sort out all of that uh, information. And then for the automations here, it'll basically uh, go through all the things that you want to automatically be done, uh, such as the emails being sent out and things like that. And then for the transactionals uh, tab, we can see here that everything, uh, you can see the configuration, verification, and confirmation. So you can have everything set up uh, so you can send your transactional emails and then also track them so that you can see if they've been successfully delivered, open, clicked on, or whatever. And then uh, you can also configure uh, all the SMTP as well as uh, send your emails uh, via Brevo. Uh, SMTP. So um, if you want to do that as well. So here for the settings on transactional, uh, you can configure all of this as well. Uh, you can even ha attach uh, like a web hook uh, or you can have, you can uh, check to see uh, the contacts that have been reported to your emails if they are spam uh, or other similar things or just unsavory senders basically. And then here, here you have your black do block domains as well, uh, tags and retention rules. So you can uh, set those up uh, so you can get everything. And then here on the conversations tab, we can see the conversations that uh, are currently active. So here we just got the welcome um, bot. Uh, on top of that, you can also go through and view the statistics uh, based on uh, however long you want to uh, kind of monitor that. And then uh, on sales here, if you are selling stuff. And then for the meetings, we can also have uh, basically like a, like a pl um, plan meetings kind of um, appointment. And that's pretty much it. So uh, that's the uh, your beginner guide to using Bravo. Uh, for email marketing. And just remember that uh, email marketing is all about building relationships with your subscribers, uh, delivering value, as well as engaging with them. So this is gonna be your uh, gateway into that. Uh, and uh, you'll be able to use Brevo uh, and its features so that you can take your email marketing to the next level.
And uh, yeah, so that's it for today, folks. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions, uh, if you have any questions or further uh, need further assistance, uh, definitely feel free to leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel as always. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye bye.